his, his main saying, he would say, examine your mind, change your ways. And even Bhagavan, remember we said, it's in talks. He said the obstacle, or the obstacles, to the realization of the self are the habits of the mind. You know, people like to tout and say, oh, there's no mind, it's an illusion, and it's all you be as you are. He says the obstacles to the realization are the habits. Swami Shivananda Rishikesh said the same thing. He said, your parabdha, your karma, is only a bundle of habits. You want to change it? Change your habits. See, if I have to change one habit, two habits, three habits, my life will be over. Another hundred more habits are left. Uh -huh. So as such, leave it off. Concentrate on getting her. Leave everything to her mother. I got all the bad habits in the world. If I were to elaborate them, it won't be contained in one book or two books. No, 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 Swamiji. So I remember, again, we were in Gujarat by Narmada Devi, and you said you changed one habit. The one habit is... <laughs> the one habit is the habit of forgetting God's name. You changed that one? That's one. That's what it is. That's the one. That's the main one. You take her name, pray to her, be with her, surrender yourself to her, completely feel that you are the meanest among the meanest and groveling at her feet. That's all. Everything will be done. Yeah. See, I, like I said, I remember Mother Nandamoy said, remember God's name, nothing else matters. All the habits, no, it doesn't matter if you're doing that. But the problem is, we forget. Hari Katha Katha Baki Sabrata, this is what she, they write. To think of the Lord, to speak of the Lord is the only word. The rest is all in vain. Mm. Mm.